What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We about to get into Crystal goes off on boyfriend, ex-girlfriend. I don't know. Let's get it. So Crystal <laughs> new boyfriend, Ed, his ex-girlfriend, Honey, spoke to Crystal ex-boo, Cece. Cece and Honey are now friends because they feel like they've both been done wrong by Crystal. After Cece and the ex-girlfriend, Honey, had a conversation, Cece took the social media to spill the tea. She posts. She said, the truth is Crystal backdoored her with Cece is talking about Honey. New dude just got out of a relationship two months ago with my homegirl, Honey. The whole time my homegirl, Honey, thought that Crystal and her dude were friends. Whole time Crystal was waiting for them to break up so she could get with the boy and it's crazy because crystal used to be on the phone being friendly with honey honey thinking crystal and him is friends that's girl crystal was out here smashing the homie fucked up because tony and crystal used to be friendly with that girl now tony say that she don't owe honey no loyalty y'all mother don't know what the f really neither one of them owe her loyalty i'm not gonna cap but i understand now why our parents was like don't ever have nobody around your man i completely get it now don't ever tell nobody how, how your man doing bad. Like, that's a real thing. Going on. Now, honey also liked the comment on Twitter that says, having a woman stalk you over a man is insane. I don't want to go through that ever again. It's very creepy. Now, here's what Crystal had to say about the situation. But it's cool. I'm over it. I really don't give a fuck. Just on Instagram me. talking about some you backdoored the girl with some girl and, uh, honey. In the motherfucking day, she happy. And how honey. did I backdoor a name, honey? No shade. My, my, my boyfriend's ex, I don't know that girl from a can of paint. Bitch, you backdoored her. If anything, bitch, that's your friend. You knew I was talking to Ed. Like, what? Don't forget to bitch? like, comment, and subscribe I didn't backdoor a fuck thing, bitch. I don't react. know nobody named fucking Honey. I, I don't know if y'all was listening, but I told y'all, like, me and Ed knew each other two years prior to us actually getting into a relationship. Right. I was in my relationship with Jazz. He ended up getting in a relationship with this girl named Honey. They ended up breaking up. She and me and Ed ended up getting together. That ain't got shit to do with me. How far we want to go? Back though. Oh, y'all been politicking this whole time. Now it makes sense. And she's calling the gay. It don't make no sense. Ain't shit gay about that man. He had to strangle that bitch out. Please believe that. Oh, I ain't never God. hung out with no bitch named Honey. Never went out with no bitch named Honey. Don't like, come on now. <laughs> she said, you know, that was her man. Yeah. Girl, that was not your man. That was not your man. And if it was, come get him back. What did you talk about? I'm not gonna argue with no hoe over no piece of what? What girl? Bye. Any that's my best friend. Not gonna be like, oh, I'm gonna drive her to the um detective so she can make a report if you don't give her back the watch. It's your dumb flower ass on. She want no best friend to nobody. Couldn't no even twist her fingers up to call no police on my best friend in front of me. That's fake as fuck. Nah, I ain't gonna lie. When he was saying that, I'm like, ain't no way they best friends. <laughs> ain't no way, cause he was kind of saying like, that's still my bitch at the same time, but. No, she's not. You you and CC cool. I think you and CC should, should just kick it. You know what I'm saying? He'll be cool with anybody with a check mark and some money. If you know Zabo, you have to know that that bitch is weird. Bestie, what the fuck? Me and my bestie would have handled that little bitch and kept the watch. You feel me? Like, I ain't even want the watch though. Like, it wasn't even about the watch. It's just the fact that you let this bitch twist her fingers up and say, oh, I didn't know she called the police. But then gonna say, I'm like, shit, well, no shit, I ain't gotta get shit back. He all, da da da, that's between you and Cece when she goes to the detectives. How the fuck she gonna get to the detectives don't if you don't drive like, stupid? Like, come on now, I ain't people dumb people and I ain't, yeah. I ain't green. But you can't sit here and tell me. Technically, she, he was warned. Either. anything i'm really not even worried about them like honestly when i post <clears throat> the picture i'm like okay maybe this to get the bitch off me for real like i'm actually in love i'm actually with my man like at this point i don't give a fuck who feel the type of way like hopefully this be enough for her to actually leave me alone the bitch still still talk about me to this day for Corey's birthday happy birthday to Corey. he got carmen's name covered now all he got to do oh. is file the papers and it'll be straight ha uh God, we doing everything but getting a divorce around this motherfucker. I don't understand. Everything but the main thing that would free me. Divorce. Okay, I just I understand. All right, we're going to go to another video because this one was short. What is up, So Real Gang? How are we doing today? Let's get into the video. Yesterday, Trey finally dropped his song, Smart Mouth. He even had a release party for the song, where all his friends and family popped out. His mom was there, and they were actually wearing the same shirt. I just thought it was so cute, because there isn't any better way than to support your son than wearing his t-shirt. Now, guys, if you haven't checked that song out, make sure you guys head over to Trey's YouTube page and run the song up. What is up, So Real Gang? How are we doing today? Let's get into the video my friend said that and then just came back like it okay yeah. yesterday i reported that crystal zabo and c were all going at it guys they even mentioned jazz and jazz entered the chat and stated to leave her out of the bullshit i don't blame jazz like leave me alone bro 
I ain't got nothing to do with y'all. Leave me alone. <laughs> She's been living a peaceful life. Crystal continued on with the whole situation. She took to Twitter later on that day and stated, I'll be mad too if I thought I was finna get some. It's been a year. Stop playing innocent. You wasn't effing me, girl. You had to be effing too. I hope I just love my man out loud. People still wanted to know why was Zabel so upset. Crystal made it seem as if he was upset because she popped out with her man. Z you know, Ed, Ed definitely a real nigga. He ain't said nothing. Zabel took to Twitter and stated, I don't want to be bothered with this shit. I'm not mad at you popping out with anybody. I wouldn't have gave two Fs if you popped out with Donald Trump. I was mad because don't play with my twin like that. You have a whole platform she doesn't to defend herself. Wrong is wrong. While all of that is going on, C mm. is on Instagram going off. Just know when I do solidify my vendors, etc., like I've been doing for the past three years, you're over with. I don't care. You either here to add to my shit. I already have or you in the way for real. I got to I got two shit, okay, to do with the baby on top of it all. And I could easily get the money from anywhere else. I'm letting you prove yourself and you act dumb. You either doing the shit or you not. I'm not them itches you F with. You you can't hold nothing over my head because I'm gonna get it regardless. Bitch, learn who you talking to. I'm not your trick. I'm your bitch. Nigga, you was the trick. No cap. <laughs> I'm finna get to work. I'ma talk to you in a few. Like, look how you be talking to me. Shit turning me all the way off, dude. So that would have been Crystal saying that. Oh, she proceeded to... Because I'm not playing about my business. I don't give a fuck. I don't say... Oh, uh, don't say you gonna do ish. Then fake get mad over nothing and try to hold that shit over my head. Bro, you would have been got the 15K, dude. Are you slow until you pull that ish uh, at basement? I'm tired of talking about this shit. My baby daddy don't even got to talk to me for a second. I asked him to do something. He's going to do it. The fuck? Like, what the hell are, are we even arguing about? This dumb shit. Okay, we'll have him do it then. The fuck? You shouldn't have mentioned Nene. Stop telling me about your baby daddy post more messages of her and crystal okay. crystal you and you want to f with me you got to come like him i don't know harder i don't know none of these three letter uh things y'all be talking about harder for the next one the fuck you gotta you not finna come over here trying to play in my face it never gave that itch you not innocent you've been doing you so for you to even keep bringing it itch up will make me smack the f out of you whether or not talk to Jazz at Nomad, you had Jayla with you. Oh, you were jealous. Whether F is my cologne, you been thought you could play in my face and shock. I can match your energy. Bro, stop texting me. Uh, stop texting me for right now. Itch, I gave. I, itch, get. Oh my God. I hate the way y'all talk. Itch, have Jazz ever gave you 15K? Okay. Even took to Instagram and said that she wasn't wrong and she had told C that she How wrong cause you a trick no money on you done you <laughs> I told your little fat well body <laughs> Oh my god to keep your funky A money in your bank in your back rolls ho I told you on multiple occasions I don't wanna be with you you wanna keep buying me ish okay trick I got done for you um why wouldn't i ask why wouldn't i ask you for money when you were lit <laughs> come on she's so fucking disrespectful you want the clout gang take your l that watch you can keep her money oh she my god said that she told c on multiple occasions that she didn't want to be with her but c we ain't even got through the first minute of the video. to continue to buy Two her minutes. things so why not ask her for money when she considered c a lick C took the Instagram and posted more messages of her and Crystal, where Crystal stated, I don't care. Blame my baby daddy. She said, hmm, okay. She said, I've been like this my whole life. Everybody spoiled me. I don't care, including my dad. C said, okay, that's not a problem if they spoil you. But when you don't deserve it, that's why you act like this. Shit, I try to spoil you, but you be tripping. Crystal said, if you say so. From everything that C was Tell posting and saying... Be. 
and tell me you don't want to be with me for the next holiday because I'm not letting you have your way is crazy. You real funny. She basically was saying that she was doing things for Crystal. But oh, my God. And the messages just keep going. Okay, I don't care. You knew I was brat when you met me. This was my exact words I told you on your birthday. You effed up, so I gave you what I wanted to give you. It's not your beat. It's not your birthday no more. My birthday coming up. The fuck. If you didn't, you should have. Uh, girl, shut the f up about the shit in the past. Is you giving me the shit or not? I got shit to do. Damn. <laughs> no, on the next holiday. What the f? Man, get some sense in your head and know who you talking to. All this issue talking about so turning me off. I'm not running my business on your emotions. She was telling her, like, like I, I feel like, I don't feel like she had feelings, but I feel like she was running game by saying, I'm talking about Crystal. I feel like she was running game by saying, you was with this girl or you was with that girl. Like, I feel like that's her running game. I don't really think she gave a damn, to be honest with you. It might have been a little ego trip, but like really caring, I doubt it. Um, and Cece was just completely getting used, but behooved at how she was being spoken to, but still gave it to her. But Crystal was also begging and pretending as if they were together. She stated that the nigga said, I need a break. I keep telling you how I feel. Nothing changing. I fuck with you genuinely. But I do also know what I want out of a relationship. And I always feel like I'm getting the short end of the stick. You are gang because you buying them. I got a lot of serious things going on. I just got out of jail like three weeks ago and we haven't spent no time together. You hurt me when you went to Miami for two weeks and went to Miami. I don't know. Talk up real just for you to come back and be distant. I want to feel like this relationship is genuine. You genuinely F with me. And right now I don't feel that way. I'm going to go home and get myself together right quick. If you decide to move on, I understand. You don't even know what type of day I had. And this is what you send me. <laughs> lol okay i don't even got the energy to argue first of all let's just talk about it y'all never belong together in the first place and i think this nigga c should just go to strip clubs i'm no cap if you got the bread like that especially if you if you're getting bank accounts especially navy federal um go to the strip club there's a girl in there you can say right now baby i'll give you five thousand give me some ass and um cook for me and shit she'd be like all right you know what i'm saying like crystal wasn't that and i feel like she was telling her that but i feel like clearly she was saying something else but i don't know <laughs> that's kind of hard to believe because in the text messages she's being very clear of what she wanted and it was money like like that's it <laughs> the whole time she thought her and crystal were actually together he stated they were all in the club this past week crystal was trying to fight her this but last thursday she was trying to fight me at bad habits because i had another girl in the section why do you care if this whole time you've been creeping because she was in the club dancing with another girl the whole mom and time mom. guys crystal was already with ed and tried to play it cool as if she was still trying to mess with c and she was mad at what C was doing. But she was only reacting like that because of what she had going on. I've been taking care of myself independently since I was 20 years old. Fresh in Houston. Nobody ever had to, had to or did pay my rent. I never asked for you for ish. You come around voluntarily doing shit. Okay, bet. Granted, I milked you out. Milked you out is crazy. Please never forget all the ish was extra. Spend your shit, stack mine. Wow. <laughs> Stop posting about me. You already on the run. Them people probably watching your page. I hate to have to send you court documents for defamation. Okay. You a trick. Never was going to be my girlfriend for real. I don't care what I asked you for. You did it. Oh, uh, okay. Geechee girl. On. guys i'm not oh gonna lie God. even i was giving crystal girl i milked you would have just i would have killed me way too much props than what i thought because this is really your trick i don't really right think you past. have to ask for them to do things you know what i mean where you at yes okay baby i'm coming i'm going home 
you leaving whatever yeah okay call when you get home save who going home with you slater and tay okay cc I like you real bad. Girl, she was lying. Because they know that they're tricking. And I don't know who exposing these messages, but girl, they, oh, it would be my fault. It would be, um, Cece. She was lying. Instead of thinking you guys are in a relationship. But wait, y'all go ahead. Oh my God. Oh, this is Then comment message. down below and let me know. What do you think of trick is? Y'all think seeing you, she was tricking? Or do y'all think Crystal was wrong for acting like she was in a relationship with that girl when Girl, who the hell have the passion for you, you dumb Crystal? I'm finna come slap the fuck out of you right now. And stop telling me what the F the, what the F you did for your last. And stop comparing. Ah, bitch, you're the petty bitch trying to not give my business money, which is clearly important because of something we got past. It's crazy. And bitch, excuse me, you ain't innocent. Bitch, I told you Zabo got your 10K. Well, give it to me. The F type of weird is just that. That's the issue I be talking about. Stop going on your rant. The whole time she wasn't. Someone took to Twitter and said, so the dyke still posting messages, but it's still proving that she was just a trick. Right like is. I'm confused it as is. why she posted them. Crystal said she's in the Y'all, I don't get offended because I know some of y'all probably be like, you don't get offended by the dyke word. No. For what? The the dyke word doesn't offend me because it's not pertaining to me. You get what I'm saying? Um, I don't care. So I know some of y'all be like, you don't care. You should call it a dyke. Dyke don't. They say it in New York. It ain't nothing. Nothing. You are what you answer to. Okay. Niall. Last night, C and Zavo had got on space right after Crystal and they cleared some things up. C stated that she did not know anything about Crystal and this guy until we all found out. It was also said that Crystal's boo, Ed, had just got out of a relationship two months ago. And Crystal was actually pretending to be his ex-girlfriend's friend. But now they're all in love. But still expecting C to do the same things that she was doing before. While Crystal was on space, she stated that she gave up the watch because she's, she's trying to be respectful to her new relationship. And she doesn't want to bring her old baggages into the new <clears throat> situation. But then C is saying that she didn't care about anything else but the watch. She stated that Crystal can keep everything else, but she has to give her the watch back because she doesn't deserve it. In the midst of all of that, C took to Instagram and stated that she was going to cut Crystal's phone off because it was that in was her hilarious. name. Because she's on Twitter too much and she doesn't even have a Twitter to defend herself. C had ended up making a Twitter. Crystal went on space and she was just popping it, guys. And that just pissed Zavo and C off. So after that, Zavo had took oh to Twitter God. and stated that everything Crystal was saying on space was lies. He told her to keep it cute on space because it didn't take him nothing to go there. That caused Zavo and C to go off on space. And while on space, everything got revealed, guys. Remember the other day we all reported that Kiana J and Darren had got into it. Yo, and while they were on live, someone had mentioned Crystal had something to do with it. And both Holly and, and Kiana, Kiana were defending Holly. Crystal. And Holly had made it very clear that Crystal had nothing to do with it. Well, until now, while on space, Zavo and a few of his other friends speculated that Crystal is behind the fact that Kiana and Darren fell out. He said that she's very messy and she <clears throat> falls out with all of her friends. She's always starting shit. It's crazy because Kiana was on that live the whole time. So you guys know she heard all of that. I just hope this doesn't start anything else. Kiana, I'll show up. I would say Kiana handled it very well. She wasn't really saying anything, but she did stay the whole live to listen to what they had to say. I don't know, y'all. Comment down below and let me know what you think. Because at this point, if I was Crystal, I would just leave Houston. This girl done already put oh, yeah, 30. Enough is enough. I got 30K for anyone trying to go to Crystal House and beat her up. I'm paying the cash. Oh, yeah. You trying to go to jail. K on her head. Zabel even stated that Slaughter faked on him and Crystal still proceeded to be Slaughter's friend. Zabel even called Tony out and he stated Y'all know her ass is in Miami. That she's one of the friends that that he's talking about. If you guys remember, I posted a video of Crystal and C getting into it a while back. Guys, she had posted that video on YouTube and said that the girl tried to fake on her and got punched right in the mouth. 
A girl named Sirak took to Twitter and called Crystal out. She said, what's cute about this? Slaughter got his stupid ass standing there and you not no bully. You come to Houston thinking y'all a big dog. You just picked the groupie click to hang with because your ass would have got dusted crystal mm. responded what you mean she pulled up on me with a gun trying to kill me over a ninja i wasn't even talking to to pull up to my Which friend is the same nigga she talking to now house because you think a ninja is there is crazy she got ex which i absolutely don't agree with but i'm just saying <laughs> Chris do be playing victim sometimes. Exactly what she was looking for. I don't play that fatal attraction stuff. The girl nah, I don't blame her for that either. Literally. I don't blame her for that either. But Krista, you can't bring a goddamn knife to a gunfight. You better get you one. Fuck. She probably end up shooting it, but I'm saying. Um, this is when you first met. Bitch was threatening threatening me and got punched. <clears throat> Pulled up to my friend house. She don't know. To attempt to shoot me or pistol with me. I know now that she go for anything. Please don't let this girl make y'all think she a victim. She talk crazy to everybody from niggas to girls. I ain't no bully. I don't play fatal attraction. I kill. He dry assaulted somebody. Who you clearly said can't fight. That's lame. But you literally hang around MFers who need somebody around to get them in the club for free. So I mm. see how they let it slide. But you wouldn't dare do that to someone who's known for doing something. Crystal responded. This is when we first met. She was threatening me and got punched. She said C pulled up to her friend house attempting to shoot her or pistol whip her. Crystal stated, I know now that she- Chris is too much of a hothead. I don't want to get hurt one day, y'all. Go for anything. Please don't let this girl make y'all think she's a victim. She talk crazy to everybody from ninjas to girls. I ain't no bully, but I don't play fatal attraction. I'll kill you or nobody else can have you. To actually pull a gun out is crazy. Crystal stated that she also tried to shoot her old best friend nephew, who's only 17 because he thought that that was the guy but he was only out there for him and crystal to see what was the ruckus all about they commented under that post and stated girl stop dragging this for real the delusion has to stop c never actually tried to shoot anyone she upped her gun because she didn't know who was in the car with you because you lied and told her you was with a ninja she never knew that boy was even 17 she shouldn't even pull it up the response was Zay let's not speak on delusional bitch I don't care what I said don't pull up on me with no gun bitch if I wanted to leave that hoe and say I was with a nigga even though I'm not I can y'all ever pull up on me with well, no let's not speak on delusion I don't care what I said don't pull up on me with nothing if I wanted to leave that and I say these I these motherfuckers out here dangerous in um in Texas and what I mean is all y'all got something to lose and y'all playing. <laughs> like, uh, I don't get the whole playing gangster shit. And you know, you can take people out the hood, but you can't take the hood out of them. I'm just saying though, like a lot of this is so petty and granted, I went through my twenties. I get it right. I'm not 50. I ain't even 40, but I'm just saying. It's just like, ah. Uh. <laughs> I was with a ninja, even though I'm not, I can do that. Comment <clears throat> down below, guys, and let us know what you think what about that. Fuck? Now, how did that happen? How did that happen, TV? I've been watching Bridgerton all day, y'all, my boy. Crystal even went as far as posting C's records when she got locked up. Not to oh, damn. Now, I posted her. Gang, you a stalker and drop my low, you dropping... Next. Long ago, in the records, it stated that C was locked up for theft, robbery, and stalking. But while on oh, live, damn. C made it clear that those charges were dropped. Y'all, it was too much said on space. The videos were way too long. Do my best to try and figure out something to get you guys that content. But I'm just going to sum it all up for you guys. And you guys comment down below and let us know what you got from it. This is what I got from it. And comment down below, guys, and let me know, am I wrong? Because like I stated before, I was believing Crystal with this whole trick situation. Because at the time, there was a lot of things going on on social media and things were being said. That didn't seem to stop C at all. She even bought her a Chanel bag and asked her to be her girlfriend for Valentine's Day. But from what I'm hearing, C is stating that Crystal said yes and she made it seem as if she was happy to be her girlfriend. 
C even stated that in a video that Ray So Wavy and Crystal did together, Crystal was speaking on the fact that she was dealing with a 21 year old girl. She had even put C in a in her last she had even put C in she had even put C in a vlog that she did two months ago. The same one that she had end in there. What was the point of putting C in there if you knew C was just your trick? Like Crystal said, she like Crystal said, C was willing to spend money on her and do nice things for her. So she took what she can get out of it. She said she even funded her new her new crystal couture business from the money that C have given her. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that. All right, which was the 10K. Hey, that's why she was talking about the business money. From what C is saying, I'm guessing the little attention that Crystal was giving her at times, like fighting back with her and arguing with her over females, I guess that that made her believe that her and Crystal was working on, working on something because C continuously said in the messages he wasn't trying to let go of Crystal and she would do whatever it takes to make it work. So why would you want to make it work with someone who was just using you? But you guys, comment down below and let us know how do you feel about everything. What did you guys get from this whole ordeal? I know they're still going at it till this day, but if you can sum it up, what did you get from it? Comment this is a hot ass mess down below and let us know. Baby, I'm no I think that um, <clears throat> I think that Crystal made it very clear that she was using that child for money. I mean, from the text messages, that was very clear. You sending her, you not. Okay. I don't care about getting up with you. I don't care what type of day you had. I don't fuck you. You sending that money. You know what I'm saying? So I think that her role in this was to get the bag, like she said. And I don't think it was to be in love, be in lust, to be in nothing with C. You get the bag and fumble it. I get the bag and flip it and tumble it. You get what I'm saying? I... She didn't, she didn't want her. Okay. Okay, I'm closer with Cece than I am with Crystal at this point. Like, it's, it just Wait, is what I'm it is. Wait, I'm not saying she her. Exactly. So why yeah. now are you trying to make it Will like, you be my girlfriend? Don't get me wrong. Was, yeah. Yeah. Don't get me wrong. You can't keep your word all the way. But I kept my word, girl. Shut the fuck up. I don't care to have a girlfriend, to be honest. Okay, bye. You just a cap on me, lying to me, to be honest. It's all good. I'm tired of feeling this way. I don't have to care about shit. I'm literally telling you, I don't want to be with you. Yeah, me too. I deserve to actually be happy. I give my all, give you my all, and didn't get anything. Cece was definitely probably overdoing her part. I can honestly say, not even told her this friend a friend. Like, you know. Cece, you play yourself out your position. Take that over, God. <sighs> I didn't. I be trying. I don't <laughs> I'm not gonna let you go that easily. I would you. I would do anything and everything. I would never intelligently hurt you. Intelligently <laughs> hurt you. I'll play with you. I want us to work. Bitch, I ain't even take. Oh, she's. <laughs> oh my God. This proved Crystal point. I'm not gonna cap. I'm sorry, Crystal, for real. I want to make life easier for you. I'm not leaving till I can make it right. You can't keep it please what you mean your apology and everything else do as you please so we done that's just it yeah hey speaker again huh that girl got a speaker again no 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 she's not <laughs> the ugly bob i would have been got that down I, she, I don't see her i do oh man it might be a glitch <laughs> that whole shirley ain't speaking up i want i want her to say something you're welcome oh, here she's so cry baby <laughs> i don't give a fuck tell me i could die like i'll be a fucking real but you're not gonna be with nobody else because i will literally hurt your weird <laughs> Chris, you better get you a gun, girl. You know what I said? And hell, in Texas, you could just walk up. Yo, what's going on? Ain't shit. Let me get a Glock. Or, um, 19. I got a Glock 19. Let me get one with this scope. Let me get the one with a hollow. Yeah. They'll give it right on to you. Um, you know what? I wanted to sing on the first because it's like, I'm over it. Say something ugly. I don't see her, dog. Funny. And then she tried to make it seem like CC was jealous over Jazz. I don't believe that. Let me tell y'all, I was mean, somebody who makes no shade to y'all, no shade to Jazz. Why would somebody who makes Jazz yearly pay in one week be jealous over Jazz? Like, honestly, I'm not even joking right now. Like, for real, for real. We know she doing that off of scamming. The difference is Jazz is going to be free. CC's going to be in jail. <laughs> you know 
I'm saying? So it's not even worth it. <laughs> so that. Jesus Christ. Jazz. I don't know. I'm not counting Jazz pockets. I have no idea. But let's just say if Jazz making 56000 a week, I mean a month, maybe a hundred a month, maybe even more, right? Let's say a hundred plus a month. And this nigga C making a hundred K a week. Yeah, I wouldn't want to be C. I want to be Jazz. Nah, I don't not about to go to jail for this bag and then they say she on the run hell no please what does, what does she have that my queen can't get i'm oh, sorry but man. i want to do whatever cc do bring the usa i don't want to bring the usa's i want to do whatever she doing with the usa's i don't want to bring How she said that? no pay no pay bring no play no pay right i guess because every now. time people be saying bring bring cars Somebody always did up in for I want to be the one that does the post. Oh no, baby. We busting them down this way. Not this way. So yeah, like right. I said, y'all know my D, y'all know my Instagram, baby. Y'all can slide in my DMs, send y'all AA log, and then we green. But no for real. Um Sissy wanna talk to y'all. I kinda don't want to give Wait, her my Did she say well? Somebody always did up in for I want to be the one that does the post. Oh no, baby. We busting them down this way. Not this way. So yeah, right. like I said, y'all know my D. I guess the, I guess they they give the person the bag who's supposed to get their bag too like Instagram, maybe i can slide in my dms send y'all a, a login and then we green but no for real and then you gotta give them the login fuck no <laughs> um since want to talk to y'all i kind of don't i guess i just got to go to jazz route you know what i'm saying <laughs> at least i won't be in jail i don't want to give her my phone but i guess okay uh let's see who that you talking crazy i'm going to take my phone back all right so that's just your fair warning Right. So like <laughs> the warning. I, I don't even got no Twitter, but you know, people that for me off of this YouTube clout shit, they would send me the shit Crystal was saying. Mind you, that's the video she hit me. Every time me and Crystal got into it, <laughs> I know what I could do to Crystal. I got real cases with my ex for staying in jail for beating, you feel me? So Crystal is call it. I'm a so let's say if I beat up Crystal, they gonna be like CC beat up. You know, I don't want that. So at the end of every time Crystal hit me, I restrain her. I don't let I don't just drive let the beat on me, you know. I'm restraining her, grabbing her arms, not trying to let her hit me because that's what it do. Exactly. But all that hurt, her she don't, I don't never try to fight Crystal back because I always tell Crystal I know what I can do. I really hurt you, Crystal. You feel me? So the times, we probably got into like four times for real. And I was restraining her and she hit me. Cool. So she can say she whooping somebody else. Cool. Second of all, when I was in jail two months ago, I didn't beg. First of all, if, if y'all know to be known, I've been talking to YouTubers before Crystal even came about. Don't say nobody name. Okay, I'm not gonna say nobody. Been talking to YouTubers in Houston. Who? I want to know. Been talking to all the best on this thing. Been doing that before Crystal even came. Crystal just ran into me the time when she broke up with Jazz. And just the first night, I linked up with her in the club. And we just been linking up ever since then. It was just that easy. So, you feel me? Uh, Crystal saying all this shit. Once again, I didn't... Did you get the booty? You said it was that easy. Did you get the booty? Forced Crystal to be my girlfriend or none of that. I asked Crystal to be my girlfriend on Valentine's Day. And guess what she did? She called me first and said, yes, I want to be your girlfriend. That's what she said. Clear as day. You feel me? Excellent. I asked her and she said yes. Her exact words was, yes, I want to be your girlfriend. That so was her exact words. At that point, which was like five months after they had started talking, talking. Crystal was CC's girlfriend. Exactly. And I didn't give her the AP. And so well, Crystal wasn't giving up no ass. Crystal was not your girlfriend. I'm not even going to lie. Like... And let me say this. I don't think Crystal's innocent. I never think Crystal is innocent because Crystal got her ways with her. What I am saying, though, is she was making it very clear that she wanted that nigga back and she wasn't giving him no ass. So I wouldn't have believed in, in um, what's for a name? Um, Zavo shouldn't have believed it either. That's cap. Like, that's not a real thing. After like, you, we officially locked it in. Uh, like, so we've been following each other since last year. But not a I real didn't thing. yet ask Crystal to be my girlfriend until Valentine's Day. You know, because I wanted to ask the respectful way. So finally on Valentine's Day, I asked her, but we've been linking, been going on vacation. She been coming to my house in Atlanta, been bringing trade money to Atlanta, like been doing all this shit. You been, my, my, okay, sorry, sorry. My, so stop. okay. She been doing all that shit. Like she kept, you feel me? Been flying. She, everywhere I tell Crystal to go, out of town, to my house, anywhere she's coming. With no questions asked. Literally. She wasn't like them other hoes. She's coming. So, too, at the end of the day, she trying to make it seem like, no. Crystal knows that I was on her ass in those messages. Telling her straight up. When she would get too crazy out the mouth, I'll correct her and be like, who you talking to? Because I'm not your trick. You better go. She was doing that, but she was the trick, though. Talk to one of them niggas in Houston like that. So, she know I would say shit like that. And, too, yes. And she still talk greasy, though. 
never, it was never clear. Like, like oh, I don't know why. And granted, I'm, I'm gonna say this too. I, I wasn't around. You know what I'm saying? So I'm not saying what they saying is a lie. But what I am saying is, it's a lot of roles that she did play. Like Zavo said on one of these videos that it's a difference between talking. And being in person. And he's absolutely correct about that. So some shit probably definitely clearly happened in person that we have no idea about. But I just feel like that would have been enough for me. He ain't going to keep talking to me like that. A trick. No, because every time I got under the impression that... Granted, though, I've been 21 before and I was getting talked to like that at one point. So I, I just shit just comes with age, bro. I'll I be trying my best to see from a 21-year-old perspective I do. Because you, I have to go back into that mindset. And it's a real thing. Like, somebody be talking to you greasy. Be like, girl, shut the fuck up before I beat your ass. Bitch, shut up. Then you got the bag. Smack her with $10,000 and shit. Fuck you. You know what I'm saying? If she making that much money, girl, shut up. You know what I'm saying? But uh, my thing was to get the watch back. I, it ain't tricking if you got it. So, goddamn... You did what you was supposed to do, you know. But I think she was just trying to prove a point. But that's crazy. She had she controlled the phones, everything. Y'all was in relationship, and uh, oh, but since I only that impression because you know, and everybody know every time Crystal came around me, is this my girlfriend? This my da da da. This my da da all type of shit. This my girl. Every time I bring any other girl around, you was doing all that because this was your girlfriend in your eyes. Exactly. So every time she I brought any other girls around, she'll get jealous, wanting to fight me. Exactly. So so I'm just saying. So all that. Even when I used to bring my homegirl for the sexy crystal would try to fight me after the club on that jazz and her toxic shit she used to do. All because I'm bringing females to the club. You feel me? She's on some jealous shit. Like, you guys go ahead and leave your comments down below and let us know what you think. I don't know. This, um, this jazz, I'm jazz. Sorry, jazz. This, um, crystal and her thing, like, I feel her. I feel where she's coming from because girls do play the field, play, they play a lot behind the scenes, but them text messages hit different. And I feel like she was being as clear as she was being in them text messages, but she was probably playing the field when she was with her. You know what I'm saying? So I just think it was acting. I think that she was acting. Um, and CC played herself or, like I say, if it if it ain't tricking, if you got it, uh, shit, you tricked. She played. We moving on. You still making a lot of money a day, a week, whatever. It ain't really no loss there. You got your watch back. So what are we even like? What's going on for real? You know. Let me know what y'all think though down in the comment section below. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.